Hello everyone, my name is Hector Mendoza. On this video, I'm going to show you how to draw a roof in Xactimate using Google Maps. So let's get to it. The first thing you want to do is go into Google Maps. On the left hand side, upper left hand side, you want to go ahead and enter the address of the house that you want to bring into Xactimate. Click on the search icon. You'll see in red with the address you'll see right in the middle of the screen. Now at this time I'm going to collapse the side panel so it gives me more canvas. I'm going to click on satellite so that I can turn my screen from street view to satellite view. I'm going to move this to the center and start enlarging it with my mouse I can just enlarge so you just enlarge little bits at a time because when you start seeing it uh, where it wants to turn into a 3d you need to stop at this point what you want to do is go into a program called snippet go to snippet create a, a new snippet lasso around the area that you want to draw. I'm going to go file, save as, I'm going to name it 1513 Lone Star Court because that's the name of the street. I hit save replace the old one that's there close here at this point what you want to do is get two points in the rooftop and measure get the measurements so if I left click right here on the left hand side excuse me if I right click on the left hand side Click on measure distance, click on another point that will give me the distance. So right now I got 40.45. Okay, so now I go into Xactimate. In my options, I'm going to import. import excuse me this off import underlay image select the image you can deselect that so it doesn't get in your way so if you click left click drag and left click again at this point you can put in the measurement 40 hit OK hit OK now you have your image now at this point it would be hard to draw to this I'm going to show you a couple of little tricks if I select the image I go to tools and there's rotate now what I'm going to do is I'm going to free rotate so I'm going to click and drag what I always do I always check to see if there's a straight uh, photo so if I go to my snap line I'm able to put a line right there and it looks like it is in there pretty straight but I'm going to show you some little tricks so what I'm going to do 
is I am going to rotate this so that so I'm going to do a free rotate and just kind of move it okay so if if it came in in this angle I can go in here click on the image click rotate do an ortho rotate select one area on the corner drag it to the other and you see how I have that line how I can make it straight so if I click there click see how you rotated it so now if I go to a snap line you'll see that it's a straight line okay so let's delete that okay now let's go ahead and start drawing the first thing you want to do is study the image and if uh, if you know the pitch would be good if not there's a lot of ways to figure out what pitch it is but since I already know let me show you how to draw this so I'm gonna to go to my roof and I'm gonna select hip I'm gonna click here and I know this is a five pitch roof so I'm gonna turn the uh, slope into a five inch slope I'm gonna grab this stick it on right here and I'm moving this over Okay, so uh, move it over to there, and one more right there. Okay, so when I climb this roof, I look to see where the um, the main roof was, and this is what I determined. Okay, now all I'm going to do is go to my break tool, select this area, hold my control key, and bam. Hit my break tool again, click in this area, and there you go. Hit my break tool again, click here, Oops, excuse me, break tool, click, control, hold, move it to the end of the line, and move it over just to here. Okay, hit my break tool again. Click here, hold the control key, move my, now this is a gable, so but I can still use my control key so I can go in here and change my hip into a uh, gable. Okay, now, so let's see what we got here. Okay, so um, for right now, I'm going to get rid of my labels and I'm going to get rid of my measurements. Oops, measurements. Okay, that way you can see. And also, I'm going to go down here and um, remove my roof annotations. Okay, so here what we got. All this down here are connected to each other see you can see because there's no lines separating them same thing here you see all this is connected together and now see here's all my ridge lines same thing here there's all my ridge lines here here's a valley there's a valley there's a valley so there's a valley valley and valley so it kind of it looks just like that image there Okay, uh, so my name is Hector Mendoza. These are some of the stuff that I teach. There's my email address. If there's something you would like for me to teach you, email me and I'll post something into YouTube. Thank you for taking time to look at my video.